Hi, Rob Reynolds here once again. Here at SparkFun, we continually like to innovate, update, and improve, especially when it comes to our own products. That's why this week, we proudly bring you this. Now, I know what you're probably thinking. Gosh, Rob, a SparkFun breadboard. I already have like three of those, thank you very much. But wait, look closer. This is the new and improved SparkFun breadboard Quick. The SparkFun breadboard Quick is an Arduino-compatible development board that uses a number of the older features of the Arduinos that we've grown to love, but also adds a few key improvements. The best of them, of course, is that it utilizes our Quick Connect system, so no more soldering or shields are necessary to get your system connected and running. Of course, we didn't just add a Quick Connector to the board. Let's go over all the new additions that make the SparkFun breadboard Quick unique. With the improved AP2112 voltage regulator, this breadboard gains a more robust 3.3 volt regulator that provides it more power to daisy chain multiple quick boards and sensors, sourcing up to 600 milliamps of current. We've moved to a micro USB connector updated from the mini USB, and the CH340C serial USB converter IC should reduce the need for you to manually install drivers. Lastly, we've made sure to add a few solder jumpers to the board. The jumpers for the A4 and A5 pins are tied directly to the I2C bus and can be used to disconnect the logic level converters from the pins. In addition, the voltage level jumpers can switch the breadboard quick from a 3.3 volt device to a 5 volt device. And of course, the features you've come to love. 14 digital I.O. pins with 6 PWM pins, 6 analog inputs, UART, SPI, and external interrupts. We've also broken out the SDA, SCL, and I.O. ref pins that showed up on the Uno R3 so the breadboard Quick will be compatible with future shields. So, say you want to throw together a quick project to impress your friends. Something as simple as a desktop thermometer can easily be done without soldering. Just take a small servo, attach that to your breadboard, then grab your SparkFun Quick environmental combo board that came with the Onion Omega Quick Starter Kit that you just picked up, and that just plugs directly into your breadboard. A few lines of code, and voila! an old-timey, quick-and-easy solderless thermometer. But how do we know it works? We test it out with our Heaterizer XL3000. So hop on over to sparkfun.com and pick up your red board quick. Your prototyping and project time will be cut down exponentially, leaving you more time for, well, other prototyping and projects. Oh, and don't try to tell me you already have too many development boards, because that's not even a thing. Happy hacking! I'm just sitting here like, duh. <laughs> we proudly bring you this. That wasn't awkward at all.